Hey everybody, welcome back. Today, we are going to visit Eris's house. Or Eris house. Or Aerith's house. It's our house. Whatever. This is her mother, Elmira. Kind of a strange name for a Final Fantasy character, but eh. Uh, no way, she's not my girlfriend. But it's dangerous. It's dangerous to go alone. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> we shall depart in the morning. Well, fine. If you want me to leave that badly, then I'll just leave tonight. There's that disembodied voice talking to us again. This is a, or a flashback to Cloud's old house in Nibelheim. Not interested. <laughs> yes, you must have. Alright, now for this part you have to guide Cloud along the edge of the wall here and walk real slow. If you try to run or try to walk too close to Eris' door, she'll catch you and send you back to your room, basically. Okay, time to head out to Sector 7. Sorry, I had a little recording issue there. I had to uh, stop and re restart my recording process. Huh? How'd you beat me here? Are you done? I'll have to go through Sector 6 first. Which is actually really small. Probably the smallest sector that you explore when you go through Megar. Sector 6. Not much to it, really. Got this old, I don't know, beat up highway, I guess. Just kind of run on through here. And there's a destroyed playground. I'll take you with me, why not? Take a break? But I don't want to take a break. I want to go on the swings. Donkey. Let's talk about stuff. For 
first class, huh? You'll know the significance of that scene later. Um, it actually is kind of important. <laughs> Especially for those of you that have played Crisis Core, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. By the way, that was Tifa on the back of that cart, and she was heading for Wall Market. So we're gonna chase after her. Or Eris is gonna chase after her, and then we're gonna chase after Eris. I told you it's dangerous to go alone! Welcome to Wall Market. Love the music here. One of the best town themes ever. Alright, first things first, let's head over here. Talk to this guy. Hmm, shop on the right. Hmm, this looks a little shady. Ask him about Tifa. Oh, she's having an interview. The Honey Bee Inn. All new girls are taken to see Don Corneo, who lives at the north end of town. So let's head there next. Well, on the way, there is also the shop that says machine gun here. It's a weapon shop. And I'm gonna go ahead and buy a metal knuckle and a mithril rod. And, oh, let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and sell my bronze bangles and my iron bangle. And I'm gonna buy one mithril armlet. Arm, armlet. Did I say armlet? I meant armlet. Gah, I can't talk today. I'm sorry. Let me in. Not into men, you say? So yeah, if you haven't figured it out yet, Don Corneo is basically the Hugh Hefner of Final Fantasy VII. He's an absolute horn dog, and uh, yeah, he likes to recruit women for his cause. <laughs> And Eris has a plan. Yeah. Awesome. All right. Well, I guess if it's to save Tifa, I guess we'll have to. First thing we'll have to do is get some clothes. There's a tailor here. We need a dress! Hmm. He can't make me a dress if he's drunk. All right, so we agree to go get the old man from the bar. It's just a hop and a skip to the north. And right here. 
talk to the old man. <laughs> I own the clothes shop, but I ain't your father. Eris, you lie. <laughs> we want something that's soft and shiny. I'll tell you why later. <laughs> clothes shop. The old man's already done with the dress. I guess he's sobered up in a hurry. Silly cloud. And we need a wig now. Alright. To get the wig, we head up to the gym right here. Yep, that would be me. <laughs> I'm the one that wants to be cute. But we gotta take on Big Bro first. In a game of squats. <laughs> uh, stupid Big Bro. Very simple game. You just press square, X, circle in that order. And you just repeat it in a rhythm. Don't need to practice, I got this. Don't go too fast, just kind of take your time. You don't even have to try because he screws up at least twice, I think, every time you do this. So if you just keep a steady pace and don't miss any, then you'll win by at least three or four squats every time. Yeah, he screwed up a lot here. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't even do that many, and I still... Yeah, 19. Usually I do about 22 or so. For beating Big Bro, we get the wig. The blonde wig. And Big Bro gets Falcon Punched! Bro's fist to steel cut to the bone. Okay, well now that we have the dress and the wig, we could go straight to Don Corneo's mansion. But there's a lot of other accessories that you can gather for Cloud before you go. And it's totally optional, but I'm going to go ahead and do it next time. Um, just to show you how to get them if you're interested. But yeah, that's going to do it for today's episode, and then next time we'll finish up making Cloud look like a woman, and we'll go see Don Corneo. <laughs>